Hello everyone, it's Hannah and welcome back. Today I'll be talking about some tips to get prepared for the school year and organized. So my first tip, whether you have summer homework or not, is to get it done and ready in time for the school year to start. I know that some of you guys probably don't have summer homework, but if you're taking advanced classes, I would recommend like getting all your work together and in one place. And also try not to save it all for the last minute as you may have a lot more than you expected you would. So my next tip is to look ahead in the subjects you're taking or topics that you're interested in. For example, reading the first couple chapters of a textbook that you have or just going online and looking up a general description of the topic that you will be learning. So next, I recommend getting some supplies, whether that is binders, notebooks, or folders, whatever kind of organization system works for you and what you think you're going to be needing for each of your classes. Here I just have some standard one inch binders. And then I also got some folders for just papers that I will be getting throughout the school year. And then obviously you probably get, have to get some kind of notebooks for like your math class or science, history, whatever your teachers require you to get. And last but not least, it is always good to have some extra loose leaf paper with you as you'll probably need this at the start of the school year. So other than the other supplies, you probably need some kind of pens or pencils, highlighters, erasers, or rulers, whatever you think you'll need for the school year. And I recommend just kind of getting this all together whether in a pencil case or just like in some kind of pocket in your bag. So to start the year off well, I recommend cleaning your workspace or where you do your homework and, you know, just wiping down the counters or organizing any kind of stationery you have would really help especially when the school year starts, to feel motivated and do your work. Along with having a clean workspace, I recommend organizing your room and just like your papers and binders, as sometimes I find myself using last year's notes and supplies to help me with the current year. And whether that is just like sorting papers or organizing notebooks and folders, it really helps to have a clean space and environment. We all know sleep is important and you probably found yourself going to bed late or waking up really late during the summer, but I really recommend trying to get into a sleep schedule before the school year starts or when it starts, being able to wake up at the same time whenever you need to leave, which is probably earlier in the morning. For those of you that have tons of classes and stuff to do, I highly recommend getting a bullet journal or some kind of planner to write down your assignments or upcoming test dates or projects as it really helps keep track of things, especially if you're taking a lot of classes. And last but not least, I would recommend packing your bag or school backpack before school starts and making sure that you have all your either summer homework or your bullet journal or planner and like your paper and your pencil case in your backpack so that you're ready to go and anything else that you would need.
so that was it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and found it helpful. And thank you for watching.